We are back, baby. Welcome back, grinders, YouTubers. Um, about to play the $5 hero challenge. I believe it's day 27. I'll show you the bankroll. I didn't write nothing on the bottom. I was pretty lazy, but the bankroll is at 546 for the year. Um, for the $5 hero, we're still in the minus. It's roughly uh, 40 bucks or so. Um, I actually just wanted to start grinding here, so I didn't do any of that. Uh, let's see where this is at. That's the EV line. Uh, we're in the minus about 40 would be $45. So let's start it off right here is our first game. We're gonna run two for the whole session. Let me just see what that is first. Um, the crazy thing is we just passed our 3800th game. Get that minimized soon. If you see at the bottom here, it shows your tournament. So we've done 3,802 tournaments. Still waiting for a spin bigger than a 10x. Um, so we are patiently waiting, putting in the work. It could be this spin right now, baby. We'll defend with the Jack 8. And we got the classic 2x on table 2. I'll get that lined up for you guys in a second. Hopefully it doesn't freeze our tables. There we go. Going to be a good night, baby. Didn't freeze. I honestly can't believe we're still in the minus, guys. We are deep, deep, thousands of games. It's almost close to, if we get to 4,000, be close to 3,000 games. Because I, I roughly think we did it the first thousand on the $3 ones. It might have been 1,200, but we've put in a huge sample. I'm not impressed we're in the minus. All I can do is keep on trucking. Hopefully we'll keep 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 it going. Okay, where we got people from here? I played this person with the pink hills before. I don't like this guy limping over here. This is an awkward spot. I'm just gonna jam. I was running out of time there. I was gonna go about 120, and then I was running out of time. We'll just pick up the blinds. I want to get a sweater one second. We are back. Sorry, I just had to get a sweater. Baby, I'm ready to do this. I got my, got my hoodie on, got my flip slippers on. Grind time. Okay, that's a defend for sure. This we're gonna raise on table two. Check back the queen. Okay, we're in the groove. Good little raise on table two here. He's gonna dunk out on us. We're just gonna raise him up. Trying to slow us down. We're not having it. If he wants to get it in, we'll do it. Don't think when they dunk out, they're beating you too many times in that spot. Yeah, it's not the best card, but still think we have to call. 7-8, yeah. I'd... So that was a bad turn for us. We played it very aggressive, and uh, he got there in the turn. Not much we could do about that. Um, when I said not a good card, you always want to look at combo draws. So when there's a seven and, and a nine on the board and an eight comes, a lot of times people are gonna call you pre-flop with hands that are connected, seven, eight suited, six, seven, all those kind of stuff. So it's not gonna be all the time, but always wanna look at your combos.
Okay, we're gonna open up on table two. You know, I'm gonna check back this time to the two pair. Forgot it was a different game. Ace nine, we're gonna get it all in table one, see if we can get a double up. Okay, we're flipping. Can we get there? We do not. So not the best start. We're 0 for 2. Wow, this guy let out. Triple bearing into us. I don't like that jack-jack. King's chop now. I'm gonna call him. There we go. There we go. Just because we're running bad doesn't mean we have to make bad calls. We can make it back for making good calls. Okay, now he's all in. We gotta call him. It's a little wide, but... Oh, and he wakes up with ace 10. You see a donkey move and then that happens. Am I going to bow to the ace in table one? Mm, I don't think so. Well, we got open end now and we're pot committed if he bets. We might have created a bad problem here. I feel like he's got more of a puck up here than an ace here, but... Wow. I guess I'm all in here. We're, we're going to need to catch a straight here, I think. Trip eights. Did he turn us? He turned us. We made the right call on the flop after that. Didn't feel like an ace. Ah! It's a stressful game, people. That was brutal. Okay, we got a 6x so let's make it all back right now we are 0 for 3 i believe the 6x can get us there pocket sevens wow do i literally want to just jam on the first hand we're gonna play different than usual you know what any calling hands that would have crippled us i'm gonna lay it down Oh, now I got my HUD on him. He's a very aggressive player. He is a regular player, so he shouldn't have called too wide on his first hand, but you never know. Got two pair table two. Oh, 95. They priced this in. I did not mean to bet out. What is. <laughs> Guys, that was a misclick. I was going to the check. I just bet 20 into two. Oh my god, am I gonna take it down like that? Is this our new play? Did we just learn a new move? Oh my god, we took it down on the 6x. That was insane. I bet 20 into 120 pot. I donked out into two people that called a raise preflop. Did that just happen? We just we just mind fucked on those Jedi mind trick stuff right there. Now we got the crazy eights. You know what? Let's just donk out again. He's not gonna believe us every time. Okay, now we'll check it. Try to get him to raise us. Do it, do it. You can do it. There we go. Okay, we got a double up on table. Oh, we just took a guy out, actually. I did raise that guy. I was playing the hands on table one. I was playing him so funky. I just figured my funky bets might, he might all of a sudden re-raise us, but can we hold? No, we can't. The hearts are out. We had him dominated, a common theme, and a common result. We're going to take down the 6x. 
I'm feeling it. Feeling it. Three is definitely a good enough defend. Uh, we're gonna call this. We need a flip. We need a flip. Seven. Oh, no, seven wouldn't have helped us. I was hoping the forward two pair. Okay, now we gotta make it back. Guys, we are not doing good in the all ins tonight. Let's change it right now. Days 10 suited. Okay, we got pocket aces. Let's start our night right now. We got a limper. Do we play his little limp game? Let's mix it up. Well, and you know you're gonna get trip aces with no draws. That's when you just mix it up. Let's just bet 30. He's not gonna go away. He's pocket pot. Oh my god, you folded. A three, so I would have went all in there. <clears throat> okay, we don't want to misclick call in with nine four. We're just jamming with these ten table two. Okay, yeah, we're gonna lead out here. Wow, we're doing good with the donk outs. Yo, we're the crazy eight king. Look at the king. every eight we're playing the rest of the night. Eight's our card. If I fold an eight, change the channel. Look at that. There's an 8 on every flop. Maybe I've been doing this challenge wrong the entire time playing aces instead of 8s. Look at that. Two 8s. Uh, you know what? I think I have to defend with the queen high. I really do. He's going to check now. And the question is do I lead out on the river? Depending what card comes on table one. You're checking, you're checking. Oh, you're betting. Okay, I give it to you. Ace four for the double. Let's do it. Six eight. Don't do it to us. Wow, I feared the eight, I'm not gonna lie. I really hyped up that eight. I thought karma. Wow, we have an eight, right? So we gotta we gotta play it. Look, there's an 8 on this flop. We're gonna bet the 8. We're gonna bet it. Look at that. The confidence of the 8 ball. You know we're defending with the 8. But I'm talking shit on table 2. Oh, you know what? It's just a min. It looked bigger. We're gonna call. Okay, we get a pair of eights on table two. And it's good enough for the win. I'm actually gonna give that to him. Okay, a six for table two. How many eights are we gonna get? Like this is insane. Can we hold? Oh yeah, we can. We got a flush. I thought he got two pair there, and he did. But the flush beats two pair. Oh, pot control table one. Oh, you know what? I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to. 
Okay, now we're gonna check it. Don't lead out, don't lead out. King seven, you turned us, he floated and he got us. guy's really punishing me for limping in and checking to him. I think I have to start leading out some flops. It's going to be hard because I don't have much chips, but he's doing what I would do to people heads up. Okay, we're going to just jam with the deuces. And he's got jacks. When is our run going to happen, guys? Got to go on a win streak. These six X's just own us. Like, I cannot win a 6x. I want to show you the luckiest man in the entire world. Over here, recent winners. Look at this guy. I showed you guys yesterday. He won 2,500, 10,000. This is my yesterday video. And then today he won 2,500. So let's talk about how lucky that is. Not only is it three different games, but he's also won all three games. Like either he's hacked the system or he's just the luckiest man. This is not even close, it's the complete opposite. The, the irony in that name is insane. I wanna shake that man's hand. The worst part is they don't even tell you what stake it is on. Like how hard would it be to like say, to promote it, not even close. Won twenty five hundred dollars playing five dollar tables. I just think it's uh, ridiculous. They don't tell you what stake they're playing. And they don't for poker stars either. As far as I remember, when I used to look at previous winners, they just say so and so won. I could be wrong on that. I'm gonna fold the king two. Just, I would have called a two x, but not a three x, and I decided not to. It's probably a little loose, but. Um, we're getting close to getting. $20 back for the week so we need three more points to get to 20 so we'll probably have that locked up by the end of the video by the time that we start yeah I think well it if we can ever get another game going if it's gonna be this slow then maybe not that's the advantage when you set up four if they're taking a while at least you always got action okay I'm gonna I'm gonna go all in with ace eight here out of position don't really want to do a small bluff. Like I'm 13, 15 big blinds there, so I think it was 13. I'm ridiculously hyper. I want this other game going. Let's freaking rock. I gotta show that one more time. Like how how crazy is it? This guy's won this many games. It's insane. I, I don't know how this is in our, and maybe it is on poker, uh, on media, like social media is for all the poker sites. Like, uh, most people are just, there aren't, uh, poker stars. So I don't know if how many people are going to notice this, but I think it's just like the craziest run ever. And I'm like 99% sure, 99% sure that, uh, <clears throat> that it's, it's all three different games because it doesn't have a bullseye beside it. So see how that one wins a ticket. And I showed you guys this yesterday, but let's show you again. Look, that guy won a bullseye for taking someone out like it's a bounty. So these guys are showing you their bounty ones. The trophies are different. So this guy's won this three freaking times. Okay, let's pay attention. Stop looking at heroes. 
Uh, apparently, I lost my other table. There we go. Okay, I'm back, guys. Okay. I'm not liking it the greatest, but I'll call it ace high. Guys, put in the comments, are we going to get to 4,000 games without a 25x or anything bigger? We're at 3,800. We got 200 more to go. I want to hear what you guys think. I think we are due. Let me know. That's that's the... And what do you think that's going to be? Is it going to be a, above 25x or will it be a 25x? I want to hear what you guys think. And will we ever finish the challenge? Will we ever get into the positive? Even better. We've been there a few times. We've been very close to finishing it. Right here we were, I think about one point we were within $50. What was this? Two fifty, dollars and we need to get to three oh five. dollars And I said I'd get to three ten dollars actually because we started at one oh seven. dollars Go ahead and put in your predictions. If it's going to take me the year, it's going to take me the year. I pray to God it doesn't. I'm optimistic that we'll finish it in January. But we gotta change our luck sooner than later. I will say my last couple nights I haven't been playing the best. I've been playing under EV. For the month we're we're not, we're playing uh, we're running uh we're running bad and um when I say running under EV, sorry, usually we want to be 70-80% and we were doing that in the last couple nights we've been uh, under 50% so I haven't been playing the greatest. How much this guy raised a lot? We're gonna jam him. These are the slowest, boringest games. These guys are just doing no action. Okay, we're gonna raise up an eight. Oh, you know what? Table two, I should have jammed there. Ace two, under a 10 there. I should not have just done an open. Yeah, because it puts me in a spot like that. That was definitely an error. I should have went all in. And we get punished for it. Sometimes I click too fast. Eight sevens. I hate this, but that is supposed to be a call here, I'm pretty sure. Wow. I'm gonna call him. We're behind. Oh, we're flipping. We're gonna get there. Wow, we had everything. Board had a double up, eight or a seven, or a five, or a heart. Like that flop was the best flop we could have ever have asked for besides actually getting there. We made the right call. Wasn't an easy one. Oh, I just missed that. I know you guys saw it. Just fold the key. Oh, I got an all-in. I knew he was going to go all-in. I didn't want to call all-in with King Jack, so that's what that was. Well, that other guy sitting out or something. No, he's not. Pocket sevens. Do we just see if this guy wants to go all-in every hand? Let's do it. Do it. There we go. Ace nine. Win a flip. Win a flip. There we go. That could have been the turning point, guys. Let's 
Sorry, guys. I've got to get off my phone here. Okay, deuces. Yeah, we'll just limp in. King nine with these stack sizes, actually, that should have been a shove too. So I'm not playing the greatest. Not huge errors, but definitely not the best. But I think I should have been putting pressure there. But we got pocket jacks. Now this one will spot smack to the opposite, see if we can trap him again. Here we go. And he gets a king. But we get our jack, oh he gets a straight. So he's back in it. And with stack size, we're gonna jam with the fours this time. Ace jack. Wow, are we just gonna go five? This is unreal. We're still in it though. If you guys watch other people, let me know if they run as bad as uh I feel like I'm running just so many games. It just feels like we just can't can't get in a groove. Don't want to just sit here and cry, but it's just like, when is it gonna happen? We'll wait for it though. Keep on grinding. I had a lot of success playing the MTTs format. The problem is I just don't want to play like the really long sessions really late at night and back to back nights. And I really love this format. I know it's high variance but it is crazy fun and it fits my schedule. Okay, we're gonna check that back though. This guy's actually been playing pretty solid here. He hasn't been uh, Playing too aggressive or nothing, just waiting, pick, picking his spots. So hopefully we'll punish him for that though. If he limps in here, we're gonna jam the king too. I will defend it, I'm not gonna jam it now though. Now I'll check raise that we have a pair. Oh, we got an in. And he turned us, we were ahead. Guys, that call in the flop, I'm assuming we were probably 75% favorite there. Not quite sure, but it had been close to that. Okay, I'm gonna check back the king. See if we can get him to bite. He will take some bad beats from that, but I don't mind letting him try to catch up. Here we go. Let's see if we got punished for it. A6. So he didn't put us on the king by checking that. So I do think that that check there really did help us. And we just lose to a6 and we had ace jack. Not mad at him for calling, just clearly we wanted a different result. Or sorry, he jammed. I never understand why people do this. It's starting to be such a popular play. The min raise. I just never have wanted to do that, ever. That paused on a 10x, but we do have a 4x. Or 20, not doing that.
guy's got no repair, bad apple. Oh, he's got the nut flush draw. Okay, that sucks that we're right away shorthanded, but been there many times. Okay, we got an open end table one. Oh, the fact that he just uh, checked here, we're going to try to steal it. Showed a bit of weakness. Ooh, nice play by him. Nice play. Got us to bite and we bit. How come they never tell me where they're from no more? There we go. We got a Canadian up in here. Bad apple. Does he not know all apples are bad? He's raising a lot of hands. He, we've, the one hand we saw was good. It's only four hands in. But I want to check raise him with the Jack-10, I think. Oh. got a pair of fours. A pair of fours. I don't think he would have laid it down though. I don't think we could have represented anything. That's the sad part. Oh yeah, the crazy eights. How I forget so fast. And the eights just screwed us a second I remembered. <laughs> top pair, top pair, and we lost. We're going to call this one over here. I don't think too many eights raise us up there. So we could have a four again. Oh, sorry, I'm banging this table like crazy. Check it. Mr. Bad Apple, check it. Be a good guy. There you go. Drop a seven. Nine. We'll check it. Or do we check it? Oh yeah, look at your raise. What are you raising with? Say in our first game, son. He, he is the bad apple. Oh, the game is taking crazy long to set up tonight. Sorry for the low action, guys. I just uh, midweek and guys aren't grinding. 3,100 people. Most of these Europeans are sleeping. We're been in the midnight oil up in here. Why do I want to raise them here? This note here that they make for you says, call the non-shove two bet from the blinds with Jack six offsuit. Yeah, that's got donkey written all over it. We got the big slick, we're all in, four X. A6, we need a hold, no hurt, no A6. There we go. Let me start this video. I don't know how I never look at the time. 35 minutes in. Got an open end here. Uh, we're gonna do that. Check back the three. Check it back. Check it back. Check it back. Check it back. Okay, we got the old straight there I think we just jam them
I just think if we do a min raise, it looks too, too, too strong. Might as well just jam. Maybe he gets committed. This guy doesn't seem like he folds too easy. And also, if he it was just a cooler, if he had another big hand, but. Okay, we'll defend the king four. Looks like we'll be laying it down. That's my note on this guy. Hero five dunks out on draws. We're gonna jam with the sixes. Versus Mr. Bad Apple. Seems to be raising our limbs, so let's just try raising them, see if that slows them down. I'm gonna see bet, and if he raises this again, I think I'm still gonna call him. He did it last time with nothing, depending on the size of it. Wow, don't wanna get committed to what I just said. What does he ever go into? A two? I just don't believe this guy, I really don't. I'm gonna call him. He's got a two, but we got a diamond. No, we don't. I didn't believe him. We went with my gut, it didn't work out. I knew he'd, at least we were still flipping, more or less, if he didn't have a king. So if he did have the two and not the king, we were doing all right. And table one, I think he's calling. Oh, he folded. King Queen nine, uh, King Nine, we will call an all in. Don't worry, Mr. Bad Apple, we're not over. We're coming back for you. What's with the twenty and this many people? Not liking it. Not liking it. We could be dead table one, but I'm gonna do it. Oh, he's on a draw. Very, very draw heavy. And he was on a draw, and he rivered us with the royal flush. There's that. Hard to beat a royal flush. I'm good, but I am not that good. And then we lose a flip over there. Uh, guys, the downswings just don't stop. Royal flush, and then we lose our 4x. And then we get rewarded with the 2x. They're trying to get us to quit, but we got a lot of fight. We got a lot of hurt. What's the roll at? Wow, we started this session, I thought, at 540. It adds up quick. Like, what do we win? One or two games? This is redonkulous. We'll lay that down though. But we have a 6x. Let's lock it up, get some life in us. We have lost, seems like, every flip. And I feel like we've been on the good side of the flips. This guy seems like a bit of a donkey. We're gonna see if we can get him out here in table one. A7. Oh my god, go away. <sighs> the struggle is real. I 
I do not like Donkey Kong in there. But we have a king. Do we get the old triple up and get back in it? We want to see check checks. No, I don't like that bet. I do not like that bet. Oh, he went all in in front of the, the king. Like, how does he know that guy doesn't have a king? So I'm kind of liking our chances in that one now. People just can't fold pocket pairs. Like, it's, it's ridiculous. They're always like, oh, if you got me, you got me, but I, I have to do it. Or you could just check. Okay, we're going to lead out our top pair here. And we're just going to get crazy aggressive with it. I'm going to do it. Beyond aggressive. There you go. Get, get out of here. His stats are pretty pretty aggressive of himself, so that helped my uh, over aggressiveness. Is he from Russia? About Bulgaria. Okay, little pair. If he donks out, I think we're gonna raise him. Yep, there's the donk out. Obviously, you could have a better kicker than a 10 for a 5, but I don't think a king donks out. And we've been playing aggressive here, so he's not going to give us too much credit. There we go. So I want to be obviously self-aware how this game's going. I'm playing really aggressive. They're not going to give me credit, so this is a perfect board to check raise all in on. Mm, too bad they didn't bet. This is oh wow, I'm gonna call here. Could be a squeeze play, and that's the guy who wasn't playing the greatest. Sevens. We're flipping. Okay. Drop an old jack. Okay, we got two pair. Nice, we take down the six, I had a seven, so he turned us. Okay, we're gonna call the big blinds all in. Okay, we gotta, oh wow, do I wanna do this? He's such an aggressive player, 26 big blinds though. It's crazy. I think I'm gonna lay it down there. Okay, we got a 6x on the right, table 2, we got a 4x on table 1, so we could turn our night around right now by winning these two bad bad boys. I think we gotta call this. We gotta hold, we gotta hold. Oh no, we, we're behind. I'm seeing the hearts thinking we're all money and we're behind there. Our boy Stewie triples up, or doubles up. Ooh, I thought I misclicked. It's not a horrible flop, table one. I'm gonna try leading out on that. I don't, that's the guy I didn't want to call him. Or no, that's the guy. Was he the razor? I thought the small blind was the razor. Did that guy just donk in? We'll defend the three, four. Okay, we got the two pair here. We're gonna bet it. Ace 10 simple raise. Okay, I'm gonna call him here. Suited. We got the 10. Don't do it to us. There we go. We get lucky for once. Boat time, baby. We did it at the right time. Okay, uh. I'm gonna lay that down. What's our time in here? 45. These will be our last two game guys. Let's close out this 4x. We just want a 6x. I'm gonna raise that up. And I'm gonna bet my 4. If I get raised, so they have an 8, then it is what it is, but let's bet it. Okay, do I pot control? A 2 wouldn't have. Hmm, I'm gonna check it then. 
What do we want to call here? How much? Okay, I'll just check it then. 6-9. Nice call on the flop, buddy. First hand, ace-3. It's all yours, sir. I'm pretty sure I played this guy. I now two hands in a row and I've never played him. So I don't like that we folded that ace. Now that I know he's not a regular. It says... Raise or called an all in preflop with twos and king queen suited. My man's looking to party. But now he has ace 10. So you never know. I'm gonna limp in see if he wants to go all in again. Do three for three, buddy. Oh, we got an all in table one. I'm not even paying attention. Oh, we won some chips by betting the, the Jack Queen, so that wasn't that bad. Yeah, we won 46 chips on hand. I'm happy with that result. This guy did double up or triple up, but. This guy here does not like to fold from Russia. Russians uh, like to see the rivers. We got the straight goods, and we know he doesn't like to fold, so what does that mean? It means we bet. There we go, Russian. Hey, now they don't call with nothing though, so let's go to Value Town. We've got the Stone Cold Nuts. I'm gonna go under that. 75. Give us your 75. He didn't call us, but we tried. Oh, we, we beat another straight too. Okay, we're heads up for the 4x to try to make some niceness out of this night. These multipliers, it's crazy how much it changes your whole session. Okay, we know he doesn't fold much, so... Okay, I got a semi-buff here. I'm gonna see bet one time. I got an open ender. Backdoor hearts, I got a king draw. Okay, now we got the hearts. I don't want to get check raised. Wow. I don't know what to do here. I don't know if I bet pot. I'm going to check it, but I think now he might bet. We can't fold. Oh, we're going to lose to like a pair of sevens or some shit. I just don't see this donkey ever folding. I don't know how we didn't get there. Open end, flush draw, king. We should have got there. There was a lot of outs. Okay, it's a good turn on table two. Now let's just raise him. Let's raise him up. Okay, does he ever call us without a straight here on table one? Let's try. Guys, that was big. We got Mr. Russian to fold. Two guys that are just crazy aggressive. This is the all in guy every hand. Both Russians. I'm telling you, Russians, they're gun blazing. You know what, Mr. Russian? I'm doing it. I'm jamming you wide. There we go. Us Canadians can fight back. Pocket tens. Let's do it, Russian. I had the wrong Russian uh, answer to my call. Wow, well, come on Russian, you don't have jacks. You don't have jacks. There we go. These guys are just fucking... Are they sitting side by side? Feels like it. Feels like it's the same player. The school of Russia is out. Be nice to get a hand against them. There we go on the one table. Wow, 
this guy just does not fold. Queen! King, he could be scared of the king. Can we get him off the seven or the four though? Probably not. There's the four. I just don't see him folding. These Russians, uh, they say, show me you hit the card. That might be the worst Russian accent you've ever heard, but I dropped it. And we lose table one. Not much we could do about it though. Didn't get much cards made a move. Okay, can we close off the last one to victory? Let's find out. Guy real quick. Zero five aggressive. I'm gonna check back a pair to him here. Let's hope we let him bear himself. Okay, he's gonna do the betting for us. I think if he's got a queen, he goes all in because that's what he's been doing. We'll check again. Seven eight is a jam in that spot, but when you're playing someone who's so wide, I want to have a better hand. I'll call him here, and I'll just jam him here. I don't think he's gonna call though, because I think he would raise with the big hand. But okay, I'm gonna try to trap him here instead of going all in. There we go. Oh, we got a flip though. Can we get there? We cannot. Well guys, I tried. We went for it. Played a lot of games. Lost a lot of flips. Lost a lot of hands we were heading. We did win the one 6x. Um, so I think we started at 540. And we're down to 506. So not the best session. Didn't feel like we did too many errors, like nothing like crucial. Uh, I don't, this won't update right away. So I'll end the video there, guys, and update you on the $5 bankroll and the yearly bankroll next video. Thanks for watching, and hopefully, luck will be, us, will be with us next time. Peace.